Good morning, home learners, and happy Friday. Now, every Friday, you will know that we do the Jigsaw Jenny activity when we talk about our feelings, and we usually get in a big circle, and we usually pass Jigsaw Jenny around, and we talk about what's made us feel happy in the week, and something that might have made us feel a little bit sad. Now I might talk to you a little bit about my feelings before I go and challenge myself with a super activity. Now something that's made me feel a little bit sad this week is that my Charlie, Matilda and Daisy haven't been wanting to get up in the morning and then because it's hard work for me to get them up I have to keep saying Charlie, get out of bed, it's time to go. And then because they don't get up, it makes me feel a little bit rushed and I don't like being late for work. So this morning when I came to work, I was just, just in time. And usually I come in really early. So I felt a little bit sad, a little bit stressed. So what I did, I made myself a cup of tea and I sat down and I made myself one of these glitter jars. And remember, I've shown you my glitter jars before and I do like making them quite a lot. And when I got to work this morning, I was fizzing because I was on the last minute. And like I said, Charlie, Matilda and Daisy, they weren't doing their best listening and getting up. And then when I got to work, I started feeling much calmer after I'd made myself a cup of tea and then I logged on to Teams to see your amazing work and then that made me feel really calm. I chatted to Miss Hannon and I talked to her about the things that do actually make me feel good and make me feel calm. One of the things that makes me feel really calm, I'm going to give you a clue, what is this puppet? that I'm holding. Who is this? Yes, it's a dog. Now, not all dogs make me feel calm, but my Betsy, my dog at home, I know Class RD will definitely know about my Betsy dog. I go walking with Betsy every single day. And when I go walking with Betsy, I think about all the lovely things that make me feel good and walking also makes me feel really good and it keeps my body healthy too. So that's one thing that makes me calm and makes me happy. Another thing that makes me feel good and makes me happy is looking back at pictures of my family and of the good times that we've had together. This one here, oh I'm sure they won't mind me showing you. This is of me and my family on Christmas Eve. Now I like looking at this picture because I remember how excited we were all in matching pyjamas and we felt so excited for Santa Claus to come. So when I'm feeling a bit stressed and a bit angry and a bit sad, if I look back at pictures of good family times, I will show you another one because Miss Hannon's on this one, everybody. This is another one. And you know here, we are in Turkey on holiday. So that's another really good family memory of me and my family in Turkey on holiday in a hot country. And it was such a, such a lovely place to be. So looking at photographs of my families and all the memories that we've shared together also makes me feel happy. One more thing, because I would like you to also think of three things that make you feel happy. Another thing is phoning my grandparents and my family and friends. So phones don't make me happy, but picking up the phone and calling my nana or my granddad or my aunties and uncles, those family members that I haven't seen in a long while because of lockdown and me being in a little bubble with my family, I can't see other people. So making sure that I call them quite often or seeing them over Teams or Zoom or FaceTime, that really, really does make me feel happy. Also, reading 
as well. There's lots of things that make me feel happy. So when I'm feeling a bit sad like this morning and I was fizzing and that glitter was going round and round and round and round and round, I just had to come in and take just a few moments. I had lots of deep breaths. Remember our breathing, we go in and exhale, don't we, out. And then think about all those things that make me feel calm and happy. Now I know that Miss Hannon has uploaded a special worksheet. Some of you might not be able to print that off, so that's absolutely fine. And it's just of two jars. In one of the jars, you might want to draw a picture of you feeling a bit sad and maybe some words, your adult might be able to help you with this, of things that make you feel sad. And then in the other picture, in the other jar, maybe something that makes you feel happy like spending time with your family or going on a bike ride. I know some of you like a little bit of time on your computers or playing out or building a snowman. We had so much fun the other day, didn't we? Building snowmen outside in our reception garden. So I would look, I'm going to do my work now and get busy. And I would like you also to get busy if you can, please. And then maybe post it onto our Teams page and me and Miss Hannon will have a look at them. So that's our Jigsaw Jenny for today. And I will see you all again very soon. Keep up the good work.